Yeah, come on. Come on, bro, smash this one. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. It is me, Jordan Young, aka Sneakonomics, back with another banger. In today's episode, I'm gonna be giving you guys my thoughts on what some fashion blogs and sneaker channels are calling the perfect sneaker. The Adidas, Clarks, Ronnie Fayeg, Kith, 8th Street Sambas. In true Sneakonomics fashion, this review is coming to you incredibly late. This shoe actually released much earlier in the year to a lot of success and a lot of hype. And the initial drop was so successful that Ronnie Feig decided to do a subsequent release following a pre-order system. And this process for most people has lasted the better part of six to seven months. For me, I have waited six to seven months to pay resale for these. And having paid the resale price and having gotten these in hand, I need to make sure that they are legit. Shout out to the sponsors of today's video, Check Check, the leading sneaker authentication platform revolutionizing the game. Over 2 million users and pretty close to 2 million legit checks done at this point. These guys have been featured everywhere from Complex to GQ to Yahoo, Sneaker Freaker, Sneakonomics. We're gonna use Check Check today to verify these bad boys right here. In terms of the process, it's super easy. You download the Check Check app, you can use my code right here here to get yourself a free credit. Open up the app and click on new check. We are going to scroll down. We're gonna select Adidas. This is a brand new model, so we're gonna go down to other, and then we're just gonna go through and take the relevant pictures and upload them to the app. You've got a few different options depending on how quickly you wanna get the results back. We're looking to get these back quickly, so I'm gonna select 15 minutes, and now we wait. The app also features this explore page where you can browse some of the recent uploads to see which shoes have passed and which shoes haven't passed. You can browse your checks history. You can see here from mine that I have a few checks going all the way back to 2020 where this app saved my bacon. The results are in, that was very quick. And as you can see here, these bad boys have passed. These are legit, these are all good. Shout out to Check Check. Go ahead and download the app and use my code down below here so you can get yourself a free credit. And now back to the video. First up, let's talk about this packaging. It's this really cool custom box with a scene that reminds me of Switzerland or Austria or even parts of Aotearoa New Zealand to be fair. When I opened up the box I was ready to feast my eyes on the shoes straight away but they came wrapped in the paper which is always a nice touch because it just delays the inevitable and helps to keep the excitement peaking. The shoe draws inspiration from all of the different brands involved. For example you have the suede material and the crepe outsole from Clarks. You have the Samba silhouette and then the creativity to bring them all together in a luxurious and authentic way, Ronnie Feig. In terms of the materials, you have this summit white suede that dons the majority of the upper. You have a contrasting gray suede that runs around the W cuts on the vamp of the shoe and wrapping around the mudguard. You have this really nice green leather material that makes up the three stripes as well as the heel. The same summit white suede dons the overlay of the foam tongue and you also get this rectangular leather cutout featuring the trefoil adidas logo and the Ronnie Fayek branding. You've also got some really nice elevated luxurious touches in the form of the leather liner that wraps around the back featuring an insignia or a stamp labeled Charles F. Stead, Leeds, England where the materials are sourced from. And on the insole you also have a leather overlay on the heel which also features is some of the co-branding. The big touch that really adds a bit of flavor to the shoe is of course the Clark's Crep outsole. It's semi-translucent, it's a bit chunky, and it gives the Samba just that little bit more oomph. If you compare these to the normal Sambas that I have here, it's night and day. OG Samba is a great runaround, football, beat-em-up type shoe. All-time classic silhouette and pretty much everybody's favorite sneaker of the past year or two. But with these different touches, and elevations you can see that it is night and day not just in terms of quality but also in terms of style and wearability. As good as these look it's important to feel how they feel and so let's chuck them on foot and see what's up.
First and foremost, the fits. These fits true to size. In terms of the comfort, I found them really good. This crepe outsole adds a little bit more sort of squishiness and a little bit more compression when you're walking around. The leather overlay on the insole as well as the leather liner that wraps around the heel give them this premium feel when you have them on foot. And they felt good off the rip. Like as soon as I chucked these on, I was like, wow, these feel good. These aren't gonna take any breaking in whatsoever. So they definitely get top marks for comfort. In terms of style, I went ahead and just chucked them together with a couple of outfits. I don't normally do this, but I thought it might be cool to see how they look with some different types of fits. In terms of the resale, they're not going that crazy. I paid 300 pounds for these on the resale, which is around about $350, which is a little over $100 over the original retail price, which I think was something around $210. So the resale on these is not crazy. In terms of collectability, I feel like this is a really awesome shoe to have in the collection just because they're so easy to style and they're so nice to wear and I wouldn't be surprised to see this collaboration play out again between Adidas and Ronnie Feig and Clarks because it's just such a cool collaboration and there we go that is it that is my review of the 8th Street Sambas shout outs to Kith and Ronnie Feig shout out to Clarks shout out to Adidas for a really awesome collab I have got to say this is one of the best sneaker collabs of the entire year in my opinion. I would happily put them in my top 10 at this point. Shout out to Check Check as well, the sponsors of today's video for helping me authenticate these. And let me know what you guys thought in the comments. Is this shoe a top 10 collab of the year? Let me know down below. Don't forget to like the video before you bounce. Go ahead and chuck me a follow over on TikTok and IG so you can keep up with my short form content. And I will see you guys on the next video. Take care for now and peace.